Welcome to Math Challengers. In this video we will discuss percent and and its relationship to fractions, ratios, and decimal. A percent is a ratio whose second term is 100. We use this symbol for percent. Example, 87% means 87 is to 100, or 87 out of 100. Joanna took a written test which had 100 questions. She correctly answered 82 of the questions. Express her score as ratio, fraction, decimal and percent. We can illustrate the problem as follows. It shows that out of 100 Joanna got 82 correctly. We can express the correct answer as a ratio which is 82 is to 100. We can also express the correct answer as a fraction which is 82 over 100, or as a decimal in the form of 82 hundredths. And of course, we can also express it as a percent which is 82 percent. Convert a fraction to a decimal number. To convert a fraction to a decimal, divide the numerator by the denominator. In case of a mixed number, the whole number is written on the left side of the decimal. Example, to change 5 eighths to a decimal, we have to divide 5 by 8. To do that, we have to add decimal point in the dividend, and 0 if needed. Put the decimal point in the quotient directly above the decimal point in the dividend. Then divide like whole number. The fraction 5 eighths is equal to 625 thousandths in decimal. Now try to change 2 fourth as decimal. <music> 2 fourth is 5 tenths in decimal. In case of a mixed number, just divide the numerator by the denominator. The whole number is written on the left side of the decimal point. 2 and 5 eighths is 2 and 625 thousandths. Convert decimal to fraction. Convert the decimal to fraction using tenths, hundredths, thousandths, etc. depending on the number of decimal places. Then simplify the fraction part to change 1 and 3 tenths to fraction. The digits on the left side of the decimal point is the whole number. And the digits on the right of the decimal point becomes the numerator. The denominator will depend on the number of decimal places. If the number has one decimal place then the denominator is 10. If it has two decimal places, then the denominator is 100. If 3, the denominator is 1000. When we say decimal places, we mean the number of digits on the right side of the decimal point. In this case we only have one decimal place. Therefore the denominator is 10. Make sure to reduce the fraction part to its lowest term. If possible. To change 25 hundredths as fraction, the digit on the left of the decimal point is 0, so there is no whole number. The digits on the right of the decimal point which is 25 becomes the numerator and the denominator is 100 because we have two decimal places since the 25 hundredths is not yet in its lowest term then we can divide both numerator and denominator by their GCF which is 25 so 25 divided by 25 is 1 and 100 divided by 25 is 4 25 hundredths in fraction is 1 fourth Let's do another one. What is 3 and 15 thousandths in fraction? 
The digit in the left side of the decimal point is the whole number. The digits on the right side of the decimal point is the fraction part. 15 becomes the numerator and since there are three digits on the right of the decimal point, then the denominator is 1000. But notice that 15 thousandths can still be reduced to its lowest term, since both are divisible by 5. 15 divided by 5 is 3 and 1000 divided by 5 is 200. Therefore, the fraction form of 3 and 15 thousandths in lowest term is 3 and 3 over 200. Now let's have changing decimal to percent. To change decimal to percent, first move the decimal point two places to the right. Then put the percent sign. Add zero if needed. Example change 75 hundredths to percent. To do that, we have to move the decimal point two places to the right then put the percent symbol. The decimal 75 hundredths in percent is 75% Let's convert 5 tenths to percent. Again, to convert decimal to percent, just move the decimal point two places to the right. Then put the percent symbol. Add zero if needed. 5 tenths to percent is 50%. How about converting 1 and 275 thousandths in percent? We can do the same process. Just move the decimal point two places to the right. Then put the percent sign. 1 and 275 thousandths in percent is 127.5 percent. Let us now learn how to convert percent to decimal. To convert percent back to decimal. Remove the percent sign. Move the decimal point two places to the left. Add zeros, if needed. For example, what is 8% in decimal? First remove the percent sign. Then move the decimal point two places to the left. Add zeros, if needed. 8% in decimal is 8 hundredths. Another example of converting percent to decimal. Change 112.5% to decimal. Again remove the percent symbol. Then move the decimal point two places to the left. And you can add zeros if needed. 112.5% is 1 in 125 thousandths in decimal. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe.